All right. I am ready for this game to make me feel more pain. <laughs> I am ready for this game to make me feel more pain. I love pain. It's great. I am ready for this game. Okay. Wow, it works. Neato. And time to make the tweet saying I want to see Yuito again because I really want to see Yuito again. Because fucking Yuito. I love him. He's beepy. He's a good boy. I don't know if I'll be streaming for too long because I procrastinated so much to get on here and I'm sitting back like, well, this is all my this is all my fault. This is all my fucking fault. But I mean Meh. Could be worse. Could be worse, really. Alright. <clears throat> With everything I need set up now, let's go. And I just for just now remember that I gave Yuito big sword. It's so cool. Oh, well, good start. Wait, there's something up ahead. It better not be Kasane. The extinction belt is thick above that area, so I can't detect anything from my end. Any other information? I think they're trucks. Two of them. They're moving towards Ceyron? Hmm? What is it? Mm. I thought I just saw something inside the truck bed. Although, it was... Probably my imagination. Was it? Okay, I managed to tap into a nearby surveillance camera feed. Those are OSF transport vehicles. Enemy or ally? Yuito Platoon is the only OSF team deployed near Mizuhagawa. Then I guess that means they're Seiron's OSF team. <gasps> I see two individuals heading towards Better us. Better not be Kasane. It looks like Kagura and Kyoka. <laughs> oh. Never mind. Of course. They're invisible. Be careful. I'm not picking them up at all. Clairvoyance. Clairvoyance. Let me use all clairvoyance. Right. right. Here they come. Right. Take that. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> I wonder why Kyoka and Kagero attacked us. I thought that Kasane was the one after Yuito. Is this is most likely a distraction. For some other reason. Regardless, please be careful. Oh shit. Keep it up! I have it! Fuck. Even if you go invisible, my clairvoyance can see you. Your power is the absolute worst to go against. I wonder if that's why we're such good friends. If you really think that, the retreat. I don't want to do this. Let me borrow this! Oh shit. This right? Now my old trusted commander is my enemy. Yes, you were a good soldier. I didn't want it to end up like this. Yeah, it's too bad. Come on. No. Yes, my power. Here we go. Oh, what the hell? I was able to get him in aerial, but that was it? Letting me back down from this. Huh? Shit. Okay. Wait, can I use clairvoyance to. Oh, okay, I'll go. Damn. Fuck. 
I thought I could use clairvoyance to see if there was like a Here real one or They're stronger than anticipated. Let's go. We did what we needed to. Were Kyoka and Kagero guarding this area? Could it have to do with the transport vehicle? They were clearly stalling for time. I'll try to follow them. Sugumi, could you send me their tracking data? I can't. There are so many Kagero's and Kyoka's. They're all going in different directions. That's Kyoka's duplication power. They're attempting to confuse us. I'm sorry. It's going to take time to identify the real pair. I also lost sight of the transport vehicles. I hate losing. Me too. It was a diversion to hide the transport vehicle's destination from Sugumi. Which direction were the vehicles going the last time you saw them? I think towards Seiron. They must have been carrying something important if they made sure we didn't follow. We might be able to find out some key information. Give me some time. I'll see what I can find out with Tsugumi's information. Yuito, there's a place I want to check out, but it's in a different direction from Seiron. It looks like the duplicates are all avoiding this area. I can't be sure, but it seems suspicious. Nice catch, Wataru. Okay, we'll go check it out. And because of anime logic, that's actually where we need to go. Bet. Oh, it's this area. Oh, shit. I think, I think I remember seeing this from some of the trailers. I don't know about this portion, though. What is this place? There's nobody here. Hey, I see the transport vehicles. Then this must be it. We're pretty far from the city. Do you think this is still Seiron's facility? I can't seem to find any information on it at all, which only makes it more suspicious. Looks like they haven't noticed us yet, but I do feel a strange presence here. I can't really put it into words either. I will go check the vehicle. Sugumi, Wataru, please cover me. Hey, Yuito. Are you remembering things okay? Rod, I sense your presence. What about your speech? Any headaches? I'm okay for now. No need to worry so much. You weren't making sense. It's natural for her to feel worried. Don't push yourself too hard. You've always had health problems, ever since you were little. That's right. You did mention that before. <laughs> yeah. I spent most of my early childhood inside a hospital. They finally let me leave when I was around five, and I've been fine ever since. Wait. Luca found something quite alarming. What do you mean? Oh shit. Hi, Luca. I know what the transport vehicles are carrying. Human heads? What that the fuck? can't be. The transport vehicle was filled with these. No, I thought I was just seeing things, but they're really... One of the trucks was already empty, but I believe it was carrying the same thing. Two trucks worth of human heads? What in the hell for? Let's try sneaking in a little further. Kasane and her team might be here. Okay. We need to find out why they're doing this anyway. Okay. So, like, Kasane killing Yuito's father. I can somewhat get why she did that. What the fuck is her motivation with human heads? That's just fucked. That's just actually fucked. That's actually really messed up. Whoa. I'm not sure how to feel about this, to be honest. Wait, there's something here? Did I miss something? Ah, thank you, Minimap. <laughs> if the minimap didn't display that shit, I would have passed on that. What's this? It won't open. I guess sneaking in is going to be harder than I thought. I can't use my clairvoyance on any of these doors. Hmm. Who are... Mm. 
Oh, nice pistol. Okay, the nice one, Gemma. Forgive the rough treatment. Don't worry, we only knocked him out. He won't be waking up for a while. Damn! Wow, all three of you were amazing. Thanks, I couldn't even move. I'm glad I have people like you who can make such quick decisions. Hold on, this might be a key card for the door. Perfect, we didn't have to bribe the bitch. Nice find, Sugumi. We shouldn't have a problem getting in now. This puts us in enemy territory. I need to be ready for anything. Okay, let's try this door. I love you, Ito Sword. Okay, before we go, is there anything <gasps> through here to explore? This gate needs a key card to open, I think. I think I saw others in this other room. Joke not intended. Hey, that other! It's the one we're supposed to take down! You What's going Wait, on? Wait, you're right. Why are there others all over the place? This doesn't look like an abandoned building. It appears to be some sort of... Now! Active research facility. Let's keep going. It sprayed something like oil. Leave it to me! Don't get it on you. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Next. That's all of them. You did well, Yuito. So wait, did I do the thing for the side quest? I did! Torch well, considering that I got this around the beginning. Yeah, six to say it's utterly pointless, unfortunately. Oh well, you win some, you lose some, I guess. Human-like noise? I don't like that. Yeah, cause I'm just that fucking awesome, what can I say? Brain field gear. I feel like I have a pretty decent idea of what that does. <laughs> this area is sick. I like it. There's another way of getting in there. Come on. Here we go. Yeah. Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. Come on. Next. Next. Great job, Yuito. That last attack finished it. I guess so. <laughs> Go, Yuito. Oh. Ooh. Why is there a key card on the floor? There's a smudge that looks like blood on it. Oh. That's definitely blood. Perhaps a researcher was attacked by help? another. Well. 
This game just wants to keep on getting dark for me, huh? <laughs> Damn, they were right. This game is like near. <laughs> Pyrokinesis will work on that nice, one. <laughs> Here we go. Nice. It's burning. <laughs> hey. Go, Yuito. I can hit it. It's over. <laughs> Sure did. I need your help. Some help, Luca. Still nothing new. Damn, like... I can't even buy anything that would be, like, better for them. Unless, of course, I can get, like, some plugins, but... I don't know. I mean, they're, like, pretty cheap for the most part, so, like... Antique pole hanger. None of them like it. None of them care for it. So clearly that's an... Maybe there's like another party member? Because like there's more slots. It makes me want to believe that Kasane and the others will join us again eventually. But maybe I'm just being too hopeful. I don't know. I really need this fucking... Yeah, it, it, it does, unfortunately. God, there's two of them. Oh, why would you do this? Well, I know what I can use later. Right, let's take a look here. Um, so we're supposed to go through there, but we do not have key card number four. Hmm, unless I missed something up here. I didn't even see this door. Oh wait, yes I did. This gate needs a key card to open, I think. 
Mm, perhaps there's something I missed out here. I think there was like a room full of enemies somewhere. Oh, but I have no access to getting there. So that's ultimately pointless. Well, so much for my fucking drive. That's gonna go out. So that needs four. This one just doesn't want to turn on in general. And this one over here required three, I think. Is there a door I missed? There is this one. Oh. Hello. 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 Yeah. Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. Come on. Fuck. Here we go. Let me borrow this. Let's go. That attack worked. That must be a weak spot. Leave it to me. There we go. Whoa. Nice. Uh, I, I wanted to hit it in the oh well. I pick that up. Come here. There. Go, spin. Ah. 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 Then again, I just think this game's cool in general. You lit that one up. Yeah. Uh what? Aaron, you good? <laughs> I don't get it, but hi. I hope you're doing well. <laughs> oh shit. Oh. I mean, crush you. I didn't have to do that, but I did. I went from a fireworks show. Ah, oh, nice. That's always fun. One You should be able to break the outer shell if you keep attacking. If your body begins to burn with fire, it'll drain your health, so be careful. Successfully breached shell. Attack now. Alone time as usual. I mean, that is indeed fair. Not good, but indeed fair. We should use Hanabi's power. Hanabi. Here we go. It sprayed something like oil. Don't get it on you. Finish this. Here we go. Damn. Now die. It's over. Let's go. Time. Leave it to me. Wait, what? Oh, I'm just saying because, you know, being alone does indeed suck. But I understand the sucky feeling of it, so I'm just like, oh. I can hit it! I don't know. How'd this one get here? Damage to outer shell first. Keep going and break it. Come on. Time to use this. Here we go. Shell breach confirmed. Put the pressure on. Next. Come on. Jeez, how many more of these do I gotta fight? I need you, Gemma. 
gets old never gets fucking old go yuito alright key card number three But a long time ago, there was a plan to develop an academic city nearby. It looks like an art museum was already built, so maybe they're using that. Force field mark. Ooh, mark four? I'll take that. Hell yeah, more defense for you, Ito, because he deserves it. He's just that good of a boy to where he just deserves everything. Something detected me. I'm using this, Sugumi. That must be a key spot. Let's go. Hey! Finish this, Yui. Leave it to me. Out there. Okay. I evidently missed these here, or is this like a different area? I'm not too sure. Okay, number four. Oh, it was this one over here. That was probably three. Was this three? Fuck! Where's the number three? It, uh, maybe it's upstairs. There we go. Why do I sense that there's going to be a giant other in here? Pyrokinesis will work on that one. Nice. It's burning. <laughs> Nice fire! You got this! Follow us! Yeah! It's over! That was a good attack! Leave it to me! I can hit it! Come on! That was brilliant! Get lost! Be able to break the outer shell if you keep attacking. Successfully reached shell. Attack now. Woo! Hell yeah. Oh shit, there's more. Don't get burned. <laughs> Just chuck something at it before completely decimating it. Oh, that was awkward. Rare. Ooh. 
Oh no! Alright, that's it. I was gonna save this, but nah. Nah, nah. Bring two enemies like that? No, 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 no. You're fucking dead, chief. That very well. I don't know if that was really a waste of brain field or not, but at the end of the day, I got what I wanted done, so I'm not gonna complain. I will not complain. Hmm. Now with this. I should be able to open the rooms down below. And something tells me I kind of want to open this one first just to see what's beyond this point. <laughs> Whether it be like something as simple as a- oh no, this is just a quick way of getting back. Okay. No problem, no problem. That's actually really helpful. Okay, I don't know what this game's wanting from me, but it's bound to be so much that I can barely handle. Oh, for fuck's sake, I'm already looking at this, I'm thinking boss battle. <laughs> Alright, Sugumi, Inabi, something's gonna happen. Oh, what the hell? What is this facility? Yes. It looks like some sort of assembly line. Hey, those boxes. Aren't they the same ones from that transport truck we saw? <laughs> what is it, Sugumi? Does it contain what I brought earlier? A human head. You've got to be kidding me. All of these? What in the world is this place? Others are being held in this building. And others feed on human brains. Oh, Even if that's lovely. the case, why does it seem like this factory processes the brains? I hate to say it, but couldn't they just toss in the whole head if they're just feeding them to the others? This smell... Where is it coming from? It does smell a little strange here. Almost like... Well, blood. there are boxes full of human heads, so naturally it would smell like blood. Those ampules! Oh. I think I'm going to be sick. This can't be real, right? Those were made by Spring Pharmaceuticals. <laughs> Let me guess. Nerdy boy. <sighs> Damn it! Fucking hell. Looks like Kyoka couldn't lose you. What is this? I think you've already figured it out. This is Spring Pharmaceuticals' Seiron factory. To be more accurate, it's an other research facility they run jointly with the Seiron government. Are you kidding me? They're using these heads to make their products. <sighs> Shiden, stay calm. Just concentrate on stopping Yuito. Wait, let's talk. Hey! Damn it, not again. I should have saved Brainfield. Don't tell me why you're trying to kill me. Now you're trying to hide this cool place? Don't you feel anything seeing what's going on here? What are you all thinking? Don't resist. Use this. Little, don't I thought you were amazing since you were a cadet, Kasani. But now you're trying to kill Yuito and trying to hide this facility? What happened to you? This Fuck. isn't like you. 
Sorry, she didn't. I mean, I kind of already hate you, but still. Fuck. Shut up. You don't know anything about anything. Oh, really? Tell us. We don't know anything because she won't tell us anything. Here we go. I won't be killed. Green drive. I'll show you my drive. What the hell? Sorry, you won't get away. My body. Fuck. This no. Yeah, I'm gonna need this. Sorry. Let's repair. Hit it. Damn. Thanks, Sonobi. Let me borrow this. Hey. Come on. Fuck off, Sheeta. Okay. Must take out. Stick you out. Bitch. Oh, that was a good shot, actually. What the fuck? By any means. Sorry. Sorry. I need to support the injured. You guys good? Thanks a lot. Sorry. 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 Fuck. She's fast. I keep forgetting. Fuck you. Sorry. Good. Sorry. Fuck. All right. Keep on saying that word. Say that word one more time. I want to hear you say it one more time. Don't hesitate. Go. Sorry. Oh, you're not who I'm aiming for. I'll take care of it. I'm feeling really good. Go. There's nothing I can't do. Go. As much as I don't want to do this, because I actually thought you were pretty cool. I'm feeling really good. You're kind of annoying me. So, out of my sight. Hey, is that all you got? Let's just keep chucking shit at Kasane. I mean, this is what's right. Alright, let's get out of here. By any means. There. Someone's in trouble. Pay attention. One more. I'm not done yet. Is everyone okay? Why? Oh, I almost had the wrong direction. Oh, how do you like that aerial there, bitch? Still cut. Give up. I had it. No. This should. No. Didn't, but we're close. Oh, now she's using fucking. Some enemies that use power can create a brain field, with some exceptions. You will need to overcome it with weapon attacks or SAS. Okay, so this, so in other words, I'm gonna see how Kasane feel, <laughs> feels when I use it. Kasane's brain field. Careful, everyone. Okay, shit. All right, let's just wait it out. We don't need to approach her, really. Too slow. We just gotta wait for it to be over. I That's it. Do something. Although I could also do this. Doesn't do the greatest amount of damage, but it's damage. Okay, let's just make sure. Hey, don't fucking hit her. Actually, that does a lot more damage. Now I think about it. Yumito, a member is in danger. You guys good? Come on. Hey. We won't get away. By any means. Someone's in trouble. Pay attention. Is everyone okay? Hey. Frustrated. 
Why? He won't get away. Goodbye. Fuck off. Just come right. Snap out of it already. Making drugs out of human heads is crazy. We have to stop them. But Naomi, she needs this. What do you mean? What is this facility for? That's... <sighs> yeah, that's right. Start I can't talking. I take this anymore. I'm telling them everything. No, I will. This place is an other research facility run jointly with Spring Pharmaceuticals, just like Arashi said. Human brains of people with powers are being brought here. A portion of them are transplanted into others to turn them into other weapons. The rest are turned into a medical solution to feed the others. That's horrible. Hey, are you really sure about Seiron? I know New Himuka has a lot of its own issues. It's not right that the government monitors everyone and controls all the information. But Seiron causing the uprising, that's just as messed up. Can we really let them get away with transplanting human brains into others or processing the brains into drugs? No, we can't, obviously. That being said, there are in fact some people who've been forced to accept it. Like my brother. And then there's Kasane. People whose loved ones have been turned into others. They depend on that medication. Human-born others can temporarily regain their senses when they take that medication. Even letting them talk. Does Karin have a family member that's been metamorphosed? No, not a family member. Has Luca or Fabuki mentioned it? Alice? Uh, Yuito! His brain is... <laughs> Yuito! Yuito? Is this happening because I used my power? Uh. My head is killing me! Are you okay? What's wrong? You look like you're in pain. There's something wrong with Yuito's brain. He's beginning to show signs of speech and memory impairment whenever he uses his power. I'm okay now. The pain is fading. Huh? <laughs> this is... Huh? Damn. Sorry to interrupt, but you need to leave now so we can call this a draw. Hurry up or the others will come. We should leave too. That okay with you, Kasane? Yes. Yuito, our assignment is complete. We should withdraw. Yeah. We should get out of here as soon as possible. Well, that's just great. I sort of had a feeling that it was like, oh, because of Naomi. But really? Even this is too Wataru fun. said he would report to Major General Fubuki for you. Okay. Uh, sorry. I know I should be the one to do it, but I'm just not feeling well. What are you talking about? It's okay. Don't worry about it. We all know how you feel. No, that's not exactly true. I can't understand how much pain you're in. I probably would have taken the ampule too if I were in your shoes. I know saying that won't help with whatever guilt or... Disgust you might be feeling. Thanks. I'm okay. The medication should be chemically processed, so consider them more like protein or amino acid supplements. It may be unpleasant, but looking at them this way might help you come to terms with it. Yeah, I know what you're saying, but it's just hard for me to do it. I know it might be difficult, but whatever you do, don't throw them up. What? You knew? We... well... We saw it happen. You were outside the hideout. Oh, we're sorry. Oh, right. I'm sorry. I know it's not in my stomach anymore, but I just couldn't... It's fine, but you have to fight through it. You can't make it a habit. 
You're right. Besides, Naomi... It must be so much harder for her. Being turned into another is awful enough, but now she has to... feed on these brains? I don't know where she is right now, or how she's doing. When I think about her, I know how much better off I am. If Naomi hasn't given up, then I can't either. I know I can get through it. After you do get through it, you'll be able to help support Naomi when you see her again. Yes. You're right. I... I need to get it together. I'm just wondering if New Himuka is stocking up on those ampules, knowing full well what they're made of. If that's the case, and they do indeed know, then they're going to have to answer to me. No. I have a feeling that New Himuka already knows everything. I just can't get myself to accept it. I'm sorry. Huh? You don't need to apologize. You have nothing to do with the hospital. I know, but I just wanted to apologize. I want to look into the hospital and do something about it. This is a tough position for the both of you. You too, Luca. Everything Karin has done must be hard for you. Sugumi had to see a lot of things she never wanted to as well. I think we've all had our fair share of suffering. But what's important is that we continue to support one another, right? Yeah. Sorry I worried everyone, and... Thank you. I love them all so much. I love them all so much. I want to talk to Luca for a change. What the fuck? I don't know what to tell you, Yuito. Just try not to do everything on your own. If there's too much to handle, let me help you pick up the slack. That's what a team is for. Thanks, Wataru. Alright, who messaged me? Who has the fucking balls? God! Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay, let's let's go talk to Kyoka, who's kind of like the mother figure here, I guess. Thank you for coming. I'm sorry about what happened in Mizuhagawa. You don't have to apologize. We both had our reasons, so no hard feelings. I'm glad to hear you say that. I really wanted to go easy on you. You were a lot stronger than I anticipated, so I couldn't afford to hold back. Did you get hurt? I only had to use one you healing item. You don't need so to good. worry so much. I wasn't hurt, and even if I was, I can give myself first aid. Wow, that's impressive. I've always studied all sorts of things, so I could do anything on my own. I see. I do remember you having a good head on your shoulders ever since you were little. Hmm? Since I was little? How do you know what I was like when I was little? Oh, I was just imagining it. I'm sure that's what you must have been like. Why is she so panicked all of a sudden? Uh-huh, she knows I what Yuito's like because she has known Yuito since me. kiddo. Anyway, I'm totally fine and I can take care of myself. Really, it's okay. All right. I'm sorry I'm such a worrier. I'd just like you to make one last promise to me. Stay away from Togetsu. Togetsu? Why should I promise that? I can't tell you why, but something dangerous might happen to you if you go there. I can't make a promise without knowing why. You have a point. I'm so upset that I can't do anything about it. I don't know what you're hiding or what you're trying to say to me. But I can tell that you're worried, so thanks for looking out for me. Be careful, Yuito. You too. Okay, that was... that was simple. Nothing weird or anything.
Alright. Let's see what she wants. So, you said you wanted to test this battle support program? Yeah, I want you to try it out. Is it safe? That's what the test is for. Oh my god. We don't have much time. Let's get started. Oh my fucking god. I'm installing it now. Okay, it's installed. Try using your power. Power? Uh, okay. I can lift up this cup. <laughs> What's going on? I'm seeing noise. Calm down. It'll go back to normal once you stop consciously using your power. Oh, you're right. That really surprised me. Nice. It was a success. What is this program? When it detects power usage, it affects your visual senses to discourage its use. I call it the forced break program. What? Why did you make a pointless program like that? It's not pointless. If you apply various conditions to the program, you'll be able to restrict overworking. It's even more effective with an organization like the OSF where powers are necessary. Nobody can be working 24 seven. In other words, I considerately made this program so people can use it as an excuse to rest. I still think it was pretty reckless to stick it in my head. <laughs> anyway, you can't fight now, which means you have to rest. Enjoy your free time. Well, I am pretty tired. Why don't you order something? Nothing like eating your favorite food into a food coma. Okay, then. <sighs> I guess I'll take a break. Although, I've got tons of problems I should be dealing with. I wish Nagi were here. <sighs> What's with all the sighing? Am I that boring? <laughs> oh, sorry. I didn't mean anything like that. There's just so much happening that I'm having a hard time relaxing. I don't know how to deal with it. It's easy. Just do whatever it feels like your body wants to. You know, like this. Just lean back. <laughs> That's so relaxing. You look so dead. <laughs> wow, that's... Quite the position. I wish I saw you like this before I enlisted. What's that supposed to mean? Before I enlisted, I only knew you through the press. You were so friendly and lively. That's when I'm on the clock. This is me off the clock. If you don't know when to switch between the two, you're going to break down. I make sure to stay off the clock as long as I can so I don't break. Damn. I think you should do the same. Well, thanks for your concern, but I can't just... I see. I'm not trying to push anything on you. I apologize, but I learned a lot. Wait, did you uninstall the program? I'll try to tone down my advice from now on. Time to call it a day. She does it so she doesn't break. I guess that's one way to live. Although... That program is a little overkill. I mean, it just blocks peripheral vision, right? It's not like it's all that big a deal, truly. Alrighty. Is there any new stuff I can give to to my team? Mm-hmm. Okay, damn, I've been wasting shit. Ooh, new gift items. Red cushion. Okay.
I am in a living hell! Okay, wait, red cushion. Okay, what else do we got? Red cushion. I need to get abandoned subway environment stuff. I can make this though. I don't know where to fucking get that, so that's gonna have to wait. Alright, but there's a Bond episode with Sugumi, so... Oh, Yuito. I would like to talk to you. Hmm? What's up, Sugumi? I think... I finally found that flower. Look at this. Oh! It's called a silent snowmelt. It's a rare flower that only blooms at high altitudes. Is this the one you saw? Yeah, this is the one. That's incredible. I can't believe you found it with such little info. This flower's natural environment is different from Suo's climate. So it took some time to find. What does that mean? It blooms on cold high mountains, so the temperature in your garden is too high. Growing it would be difficult. Oh, I guess that's why they always wilted. Oh. No, it's amazing that the flowers bloomed at all. I would like to try growing them myself, but... Is there a problem? Oh, you did say it was a rare flower. Yes, you can't normally get seeds or sprouts. There isn't any data about its natural habitat either. There isn't any information about how to collect them yourself or where to look. I'm stuck. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. If they were in my garden, that means they probably grow somewhere in New Himuka. I... I want to search for this flower. Honestly, I felt bad about leaving all the searching to you. So I looked into it a little myself. The gardener who planted this flower already passed away, so I haven't got a single clue where he got it. That's sad. I'm sure he was good at what he did. Yeah, he spent a lot of time and care to raise it in our garden, and I figured out why I remembered this flower in the first place. After my mom died, I was really sad for a very long time. The old gardener, he knew she liked those flowers, so he planted them for me. I see. So, I'm glad I know their name, at least. Thank you. But... you haven't seen the actual flowers yet. It must be frustrating. Still, that's good enough for me. Thanks to your thorough research, I can look at pictures of the flower whenever I want. You want to see the real thing, don't you? I'll check some more- Oh my gosh, she's too huh? kind. Oh, well... I'd like to see it if I can, but you don't have to go out of your way. I promised I would find it. So, I don't want to give up. Okay. Thanks, Sugumi. And I'll help in any way I can. Okay. She was really excited. She can be pretty stubborn sometimes. I didn't know that about her. Although, the fact that she let me see her like that means she's starting to open up. That makes me kind of happy. Hell yeah! Level up the bond, please, the for love of God. Yes! The planted before are about to bloom. When they do, I want to show you, Yuito. I'm looking forward to it. You're good at taking care of plants. You're good at taking care of me. Uh-huh. You're good at mm -hmm. taking care of people. Huh? Really? Oh, man. You're making me blush. Yes! Let's go. Um, Yuito? Would you... No, never mind. Hmm. Did you want to say something? Just let me know when you want to talk. Alright, what we got here? Here's a red cushion. I don't know what the fuck you're gonna do with it. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, 
I want to talk to Luca for a change. Oh, okay. Fucking fine. <laughs> Fucking fine. We'll talk to Luca. God. How have you been feeling lately, Yuito? I'm feeling great. Thanks for asking. Of course. Make sure to rest when you need it. Part of being OSF is taking care of your body. See you around. Are you going to work out now? Yes, my daily routine. Would you like to join me? Light exercise is good for maintaining your health. You're right. Okay, I'll work out with you. Maybe you can make a training program for me. I would be happy to. I promise to make the program that best suits your body type and fighting style. Ooh. Great, thanks. I like the sound of this. I like the sound of this. Ugh. I'm beat. I'm so thirsty. Do you want some water, Luca? <sighs> no, you should drink it. I have this. What is that? A special protein drink that I concocted. It's best to drink it within 45 minutes of exercising. I've never had one. Is it good? I made it strawberry flavored, so it's easy to drink. The intake of protein is essential for building muscle. Not only do you work out, you even worry about your nutrition. That's amazing. Protein is well known to people who like exercise. It's nothing to be surprised about. It's not just that. The program you just went through was pretty hard. You're really stoic about it. Why do you want to train so much? Well, because I'm small. When compared to those around me, I'm always at a strength disadvantage. So I want to do all I can to lessen that disadvantage. A strength disadvantage? But why does that matter? There's almost no one as good as you in a real fight. You are a Septentrion, and you have top-class strength when it comes to a fight with powers. I do not want to rely solely on my power. Why not? You have an amazing one. I don't see the problem in relying on it. Let me put it another way. Power is something you are born with. It cannot easily be changed. However, muscles are different. The harder you work, the stronger they become. Isn't that amazing? Huh. Um... I guess it does seem pretty amazing, maybe. Yes, you're beginning <laughs> to understand. Also, my brother is always ahead of me. No matter how much praise I get, I can never equal him. That makes me want to work hard. I see. I definitely understand that. Thank you for saying so. Since you are here, I'll tell you my secret. What is it? Wait just a moment. This is the backpack you always wear. Oh, that's heavy. What's in this? I've made adjustments to my daily routine to train my muscles. I have weights inside my clothes as well. The fuck? You call them adjustments, but it sounds like torture to He's me. He's Goku. He's fucking Goku. These extreme methods might be the secret to his strength. Will you put some weights in my clothes too? Of course. They are custom made to be removable. So I will put this here, and there you are. Great. Now I'll try to walk. Whoa! Oh, my body is swaying just from moving a little. <laughs> it's not very heavy, but it will be difficult until you are used to using your core. You can borrow them if you like. Now, I'll do another set. You can keep going? Yes. I still have a lot left to do. Oh my goodness. You can take a rest if you are tired. That's a Septentrion for you. I can't believe he always wears weights. But there's something kind of desperate about the way he's exercising. I feel like he's pushing himself too hard. Can he really handle it? Speak for yourself, motherfucker. I never expected you to be so odd, Yuito. What? Huh? Really? I thought I was pretty normal. What is normal in the OSF is not what most people call normal. It's very intriguing. Okay, there we go. Finally, bond level two with Luca. Okay. That's at least very helpful. Team bond level two. Let's go. I 
I think I'm starting to understand you a little better. Really? I'm so happy to hear you say that. <laughs> yes, I love that so much. Oh my god. What? Alright. Let's give Gemma what I got. Are you sure? Yes, take. Gemma, have you gotten a little bigger? Hmm, have I? My training has been going well lately. Wow, did you have a change of heart or something? It's a little embarrassing, but I don't want you to get better than me. You can laugh at me for being a silly old man. All right, bond level three, let's go. Status, ooh, okay, that's actually helpful. Forms an attack that can break shells. That's perfect, actually. I'll be there to back you up. Don't let anything get in your way. It's comforting to hear you say that. All right. Oh, right. I've, I've been leveling up. Whoops. <laughs> oh, right. I can do this. Still so much more to get, even after getting all of this. What the fuck? Uh... <laughs> Alright, and let's go to the let's go to the subway just to get the stuff to give to Sugumi. Because that's important to me. Fuck you, Ito, you found it. What don't what do you mean thanks? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> fuck, I'm dying. Do I have any other presents outside of not just a hero figure, but I've already given that to And again, I don't know how to get that one item, so that's gonna have to wait. best, alright? Just saying. 
I had to time everything so fucking poorly, didn't I? To the point where I have to hear that thing bark. I'm in hell. That's great timing. That moment when you want things to shutteth the fucketh upeth. It proceeds to do the opposite of shutting the fucketh upeth. And what level am I again? Level 30, okay. Wait for her to shut the hell up. That's kind of all I can do. In the meantime, actually, I never bothered to look at the visuals. Yeah, that that's not that's not those aren't no it's not no it's not Okay, but I got good shit. So like, why does the Baki hair clip actually look like um, looks like a ding ding. Like, you know, like the fucking uh. Yeah. <laughs> Boom. I made best girl look good, just saying. She looks like a sociopath. I did good. I did good. I made a sociopath. I should try to get a little rest. That happens. Mm -hmm. Oh, a message from Major General Fubuki? It's Fubuki. I want an update on your situation. Rendezvous where we met previously. I got a message from Major General Fubuki. Did everyone else get it too? I did. I did too. I think he's talking about the safe zone. He said he's under surveillance, so I am sure he just wanted to play it safe. But 
Major General Fubuki is with Spring Pharmaceuticals, right? Those ampules. Do you think he knows about that factory? It would be strange if he didn't. He might have a purpose for calling a meeting so soon afterwards. The fact that the OSF hospital prescribed the drugs must mean the government's getting products from that factory in some shape or form. Could Major General Fubuki be the go-between? Does that mean he's an enemy too? Even after everything he's done for us? Hmm. It could just be one of the ways he goes about pretending to obey the government. We can sit here and doubt his intentions all day, but we're better off just asking. You have a big heart, Yuito. Your trusting nature is one of your most likable features. I should really follow your example. It's because he's sincere. I think our skepticism might provide him a nice balance. <laughs> that might be true. Nice boy. Sorry to call you out here. While I accepted Luca's generous invitation the last time, I feel it would be dangerous for me to frequent your hideout. There's a good chance the team surveilling me will notice. We appreciate your consideration. Wataru told me what happened in Ceyron. I've also given the government a report that won't affect our activities. What? Is that safe? Your family is spring pharmaceuticals. That's precisely why I did. Reporting my own family's wrongdoings only gets the government to trust me more. Besides, Karin and I were the first ones to propose that research facility. What? I think you already know about Alice. She's still being held in that facility as an other. We enticed Ceyron in order to protect her, knowing full well they would abuse their research. The results of which were the ampules and the uprising. We were fools. What's going on with this country? Don't get to tell me twice, like... incited an uprising, but there's still a new Himuka city just like ours. Suo's conducting human experiments, and Seiron is basically doing the same thing. All of it being done to develop new weapons to fight the threat of the others. One chose to strengthen powers, and one explored a method to control the others themselves. What are others, anyway? I've heard they suddenly began appearing after the Spring of Extinction, but not much is known about them still. That's true. I guess the only other thing we know is that they're created in the Extinction Belt. Some are saying they're wild animals that experience sudden mutations, but are they really wild? It's very possible that the government is hiding what they actually are. That is the crux of it. Huh? Even the public can sense something different about the others. So, Focusing on that point will nullify the government's personality rehabilitation efforts. Like exposing a government secret to every new Himuka citizen? Just like my brother did in the uprising. Exactly. Karan and I once plotted to send a video of a human at the moment of being metamorphosed straight to the minds of every citizen. But we couldn't find any definitive video to serve as our evidence, and I was hampered after they threatened Karan. So that's why you let the government turn you into a spy? Yes, but now they should have Nagi's data from when Naomi was metamorphosed for research purposes. They took his memory when they subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Now that you mention it, Nagi seemed like he had no idea about Naomi's metamorphosis after he was discharged from the hospital. But, but wouldn't that cause brain damage? Extracting a specific memory is a dangerous process, but that's hardly even a concern to them. You all have the same memory of her metamorphosis, but attempting to digitize and extract it is too risky. That's why we need Nagi's stored memory data. It's already been extracted. We can send the data via Arahabaki to every citizen as proof of the government's inhumane acts. The people are ready to hear it. Can you access it? Yes. I received permission to enter the secure site while you were heading out to Ceyron on your last assignment. I've been provided with a one-time use pass. Nagi's stolen memory, where is it stored? I think they're storing it in the old OSF hospital you infiltrated before. I'm sorry for not having more concrete intel, 
but that facility was used to research powers. It's very likely it's there. Could you infiltrate the old hospital after the platoon has been reorganized? Reorganized? Uh, I forgot about that. I'm... I'm staying in Yuita platoon. This isn't... This isn't the world I want either. I see. So Hanabi is the only one that needs to be transferred. No, I'll stay too. Are you sure? Staying with us could mean being targeted by the government. Then we'll deal with it if it comes to that. After all the awful things we learned, I can't just sit here and do nothing while my friends are trying to do something about it. You don't care if it brings trouble to your family? No. Damn. And Damn. Damn. It wasn't just my uncle who knew, but my father too. Thank you, Hanabi. Your help means a lot to me. I'll leave you to recover Nagi's memory from Naomi's metamorphosis. I'd like to go myself, but I don't want them revoking my access to Arahabaki, so I have to lay low for now. You've made a lot of waves, Yuito. You need to be careful. This will be your second time infiltrating the hospital. Yes, I will. By the way, I can send you some data to help you bypass the old hospital security system. I may not be as good as my sister, but I can still put together a program or two. Please use this to aid your infiltration. Thank you. Well, good luck. Alrighty then. I'm with you, Commander Yuito. I'm really glad the whole platoon was able to work as a team. We're all in this together. Alrighty. Um... Tsugumi, we can't take that with us. <laughs> she did not care. I've already completed it. Fuck yes. Ha <laughs> get fucked. <laughs> Alright, well, let's just go to the abandoned hospital. Or I guess old hospital. Same technical difference. Oh, okay. Um. You can't see it, but the other is still around. Use SAS to find it. Oh shit, that was fast. Anywhere that looked like a place data would be stored when you came here looking for Nagi before. Allies you can call into during battle to strengthen your bonds. If it's here, it must be deeper inside the building. Yeah, it's over. Probably somewhere. Okay, that's pretty cool. Give it 
everything you've got! That extra XP game there. System with Major General Fubuki's program. You can proceed safely. Understood. Jesus. I need your help. Why is there so many ones that are just fucking invisible? I'm using this, Sugumi. I love that so much. Yes, my power. It's down. Give it everything you've got. Fuck. Hit it. 
Uh, I can explain. Go, Yuito. Finish this, Yuito. Now die. There. Huh? Watch the enemy. Keep it up. He's down. Give it everything you've got. Next. I'm going to get stronger. All right. Good job. There were a lot of them. Eh, there wasn't enough of them. I need to hydrate, but why, Jordan? Why? I'm gonna suffocate one of these days. All right, max psi gauge. Hell to the fucking yes. Revive speed up. Hmm. Manny hit 200 followers today. Oh shit! Shit! Good fucking shit! Hell yeah! Fucking well deserved! Proud of the bitch. Proud of the fucking bitch. Yeah. Looks like there's a resource nearby. Do you remember the layout of the building? You were admitted to this hospital when you were little. Uh, that's what I hear, but I don't remember it at all. I guess I was too young. Alright, what's this over here? Hey! Son of a... Uh, one more! <laughs> yeah. Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. Naturally. Okay, where to now? I need your help. Try sneaking against me again, buddy. I can hit it. It's over. I just love how I fucking snapped at him. Just, I'm just like, get fucked, asshole. Do you need help? We can't go further. Do we look for a different route then? That or break our way through here. I don't think we need to resort to that. We should be able to get by using my power. We're always together, but I also look forward to spending even more time with you. Alright, let's do some shit. Let's be a little crazy. Because that's always fun. Plus, I want to hear psychopathic Yuito again. Endure it! Show me what you have, Yuito. Next. Yeah. I'll protect you all! I'll destroy everything! Really good. I love psychopathic Yuito. I feel the power coursing through me. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's never going to get old. That is never going to get old. I love that way too much. Ah, uh, I might be a little crazy.
Uh huh. Wait. Uh, I can't. Wait. I can't buy those. Vase pause analysis. Where the fuck do I find those bitches is what I want to know. I need to find out where I can find those and then slaughter their entire race. That's a new one. Next. What the hell? The shell is broken. Give it everything you have. Hey. Thanks, Navi. You took it down, Yurita. Yes, I did. Natural fucking Lee. Um. Yes, my power. Fuck. Keep it up. Leave it to me. That works. That was brilliant. I train every day, so I'm ready to go to the front lines whenever I need it. Watch the enemy. I don't know why I did that. Let me borrow this. I wanted to switch to this. Come on. Go, Yuito. Now die. Come on. I need your help. I keep finding these, they're probably like backstories or something, like some sort of lore for this area. up here that we should worry about. Uh, where the fuck did I come from? Ah, okay. Do you need help? Watch the enemy. I have it. Keep it up! things they're just everywhere again I'm assuming this is like obvious lore for the area but I'm too lazy to read so like Hell. Come on. Now die. 
I just love the, him getting hit in the fucking face for that. I'm trying to do that. I love psychopathic Yuito. This is pretty rare. And then just casually going, this is pretty rare. Oh, wow. <laughs> I didn't cause mass genocide while I was gone, right, guys? Then it's just like, okay, what the fuck, Yuito? Hmm. Okay. It's down. I don't know why I try that. Okay, that was my own fault, I think. Even though I pressed the dodge button. Okay, that was terrible on my end. I ran straight into that. Yuito, my power 
may be helpful. Let's go. Let's use brain drive. I hit it. I can hit it. So let's go. That was impressive. You say power? I don't know why I try that. Oh, that missed. It's down. Give it everything you've got. Now die. That should be a good amount of XP. Yeah. I'm sorry. What? Whoa. Nice. Here we go. You should be able to break the outer shell if you keep attacking. Fuck. Pressing wrong buttons. Fuck. Come on. If your body begins to burn with fire, it'll drain your health, so be careful. Fuck. Fucking hell. This is bad. Fucking hell. I was like saying, can I play the game instead of getting just like completely shot at by everything? This is pretty rare. Yeah. I'm going to get stronger. Hey Yoshiro. How you doing? Oh, thank you for the host. Really appreciate it. What do you mean that was too many, Yuito? We fucking destroyed. There was no proof of anything bad happening. We did fucking amazing. Oh, why did it bring me all the way to the bottom? This hurts to look at. Oh, That hurts to look at! My babies! Don't just do this to me, game. Not cool. Fucking toying around with my feelings. Let's see, as per usual, there's nothing in the shop. Did level up, though. Evidently, I get three BP per level up, it looks like. Which, I mean, hey, I'm not gonna complain at. Okay. doesn't look like they're storing data anywhere. I don't even see anything resembling research equipment. I think the facility is underground, but there weren't any stairs leading down from the first floor. We'll just have to comb the area ourselves. If this is where they conducted his personality rehabilitation, Nagi's data should be here. I wonder if Nagi managed to get away. I had all of you there to rescue me, but he was alone. You're still as kind as ever. Oh, cool, of course! Nagi! You did come back. Of course you did. I mean, we're best friends, aren't we? Looks like Nagi received even more personality rehabilitation. Because Nagi was regaining his original personality the last time we saw him? Personality rehabilitation. 
You traitors against glorious new Himuka are the ones who need rehabilitation, not me! There's no need to worry, Yuito. They specifically told me you need to be alive when I bring you in! Okay, alright. So, long story short about this game, characters have powers. Oh, this it, one has Daddy. Right, you, I, don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you, but I want to overpower you. Never thought about this being an option, Nagi. Come here, Nagi. Hey, don't you go running from me, buddy. Don't you go running from me. Okay, I'm gonna die. That's why I'm doing this. I'm steering my friend to the right path. Aren't you supposed to be a challenge, Nagi? I've seen a lot of people whose personalities suddenly change like that. I should have started investigating earlier. If you did, you would have been personality rehabilitated too. Let's do our best to stop him from now. <laughs> yeah. Me in a nutshell. That almost brought him to a little below half health, so I can't say I did terrible. Shoot at him! <laughs> Man, that hurt! I can still fight. Okay, that does some decent damage. Yuito, a member is in danger. You guys good? Thanks a lot. Oh, I didn't fucking break him. Leave it to me. Thanks. It's good to have you on the team. Shoot him! <laughs> Fuck. Good points. Yes, clairvoyance, Rita. We'll be able to see Nagi. Fuck, I tried. Oh, fuck. You good, Yuito? Nagi changed. There might be an opening. Oh, let's go. Okay, that did some good health. Right, now he's in the drive state. Come on. Maybe we can attack him inside the air bubble. If we use teleportation. Fuck. Yeah, here we go. I'll crush you. Good. <laughs> I'll crush you. Good. Keep it up. You're not as annoying as Kasane. Please stop this. <laughs> Too bad for you. I'm not done yet. Yeah. <laughs> Guys. <sighs> You 
toe! Not again! If I pass out during the fight! Come on, we won though. We kicked his fucking ass. Yuito, I know that was scary. They're all done with the tests now. Honest. Let me see that brave face. You're okay. It's all over. Mommy? Mommy. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> A dream about my mom? Why would I have that now? Oh, right. This ceiling. It looks like the hospital room from when I was a kid. You got a hydrate again? Oh, the smell, too. Smell. Where am I? <laughs> Huh? I can't use my powers? You can't use your powers here. Those restraints are designed to nullify your abilities. You're such a fool. All you had to do was play the patriotic hero, and you would have had the world on a platter. Who are you? Just a humble staff member of this facility. We've met a number of times when you were a child, but I'm sure you don't remember. We did? Have you forgotten about your time here in the hospital with your mother? Which means this is still somewhere inside the old OSF hospital. Where are my friends? No idea. Your friends are outside my jurisdiction. I'm in charge of duds. You mean people without powers? Hmm. That's right. I was in charge of the experiments involving you and the Travers brothers. Unlike Karin and Luca, it seems like your psionic hormone levels are dropping. What? Now that I think about it, your psychokinesis was activated under some unconventional circumstances. Duds have an extremely low chance of manifesting powers in the first place. This could mean there's something special about your cerebrum. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Wait, I'm a dud? The fuck? Oh, so you're missing your memories from when you were a dud too. This is going to be tricky. It seems Tavid your brain is accumulating save. damage then as save you manually. use your power. I need to run some tests before I ask you any questions. I'm sure you've experienced episodes of sudden memory loss or having difficulty remembering your childhood. Wait! Please, explain it to me so I can understand. <sighs> it's simple. You were born a dud. Then you were hospitalized here with your mother because this was still the OSF hospital at that time. We know that duds are capable of acquiring potent powers. The country sends all duds to this hospital, where we run medical experiments on them. I'm a dud? I had no powers? In any case, it's time to go back to sleep. What the fuck? Damn it! I can't stay awake. Yuito! <sighs> Are you all right? Oh, thank God. I thought I was about to choke Major a bit. Major General Fubuki? How? The program he gave us was able to tap into the facility's surveillance camera feed. I knew it would be dangerous infiltrating this place. I made sure I would be available if something happened. Thank you very much. I'm glad you guys are all right. I'm sorry, Major General. We couldn't get Nagi's memory data. Right, Nagi. What happened after that? You suddenly collapsed, and Nagi... He took you, and then used you as... as a hostage. We were afraid of hurting you, so we couldn't attack him. We were locked inside a room. There was... strange equipment. I think it was for personality rehabilitation. The Major General Fubuki showed up before any of us were rehabilitated, so we're all okay. You don't have to worry about us. 
Sorry. You're always rescuing me. Thanks, guys. Wait. It looks like... others are gathering. I've disconnected the alarm, but they should already know Yuito's trying to get away. We have to escape the hospital. I've already shared the way out with Wataru. I'll hold them off here. But... Don't forget, I'm a Septentrion. I can handle myself. Take this. Don't lose it. What a lad. No matter what. What a lad. What is it? I'll tell you when we get out of here. Now go. You'll only get in my way. Okay. I don't see any safe area near here for teleporting. We have to run. Got it. Please, be careful. I had no power. I was a dud. I'm more confused than shocked. It's too much to take in. Next? Alrighty then. Nagi must have attacked Yuito under orders from the new Himuka government. We should consider him as being completely under the government's control. I can hit it! Come on! Let's go! Do you need help? Not a disabled teleportation. Okay. Wait, is there anything down here that I can grab? No, we're just gonna kill them all outright. Now stretch. Now pain. What's he? What's here? Psychopathic Yuito again. Hey, look at them just getting eye cane. Look at how fucking pathetic they are. That was fun. Former Major General Karin? Oh shit. Yuito, it looks like you finally become a traitor too. What do you mean? Did the new Himuka government brand Yuito a traitor? Yes. I doubt you'd be allowed inside Suo. Ugh. Come to Seiron. You'll all be accepted as one of them. You're asking us to help Seiron. The same people who are sticking human brains inside others? Meanwhile, New Himuka is conducting experiments to metamorphose humans all in the name of producing a strong power. And at its center is the great city Suo. They're both twisted. They're both crazy. Then what do you want to do? Run to the religious fanatics in Togetsu? They're a religious state. They'd probably be open to taking in criminals such as yourselves. But Togetsu won't necessarily be a safe place this time around. This time? Just a figure of speech. Yeah. New Himuka won't be able to get us in Togetsu. They're an independent city. It is a little shady, though. Is that oh, why God. you came here, Karin? To tell us this? <laughs> it was just an afterthought. However, take this if you're going to Togetsu. I can't drink this. I won't. Whether it's human blood or brains, you need to drink it if you want to live. Either way, you'll lose all your memories and powers if you choose to do nothing. The drugs are simply giving you time, so you have to drink it whether you like it or not. He's up to something. But what is it? Most likely saving Fabuki. 
Should we be helping him? No. Come back to the hideout. Major General Fubuki wanted me to tell you not to worry about him. Besides, I can at least monitor his status from here. Come back so we can make a plan on whether we're helping him or running to Togetsu. All right. Okay. Hey, good job, everyone. Man, this unit's so cozy. Wataru, what are you doing here? I had a meeting with Major General Fubuki. I was supposed to escape to the hideout if they found out you guys snuck into the old hospital in Lokusho. I mean, I can navigate you anywhere as long as I have a PC and sign at. Which means that Fubuki predicted Yuito would be branded a traitor. So, he told Wataru to come here, since he is Yuito Platoon's operator. If they're going to make Yuito the bad guy, it makes sense to take out the person who knows what Yuito Platoon is up to. Good thing Wataru got here when he did. Otherwise, they may have subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Yep, that's basically it. I made sure they didn't know where this hideout was before I left. This was originally a unit for the Sumeragi family. It'd be bad if Chief Kaito found out we're here. But it seems like we're fine for now. I haven't told my brother that we're using this unit, but we should be careful. We own many others, so I don't think they'd find this place right away. In any case, I can't believe my brother made me into a traitor. Yuito... It's really made it clear to me that he sided with the government. Not that I didn't already know that. Anyway, since I'll be staying here from now on, rest assured that nobody will find this hideout. More importantly, do you still have the thing Major General Fubuki gave you? I have it, right here. What is it? It's for Arahabaki, a one-time-use key code generator. Why would he give something that important to... Major General Fubuki entrusted the key code generator to you because he thought he might not come back alive. Have you heard anything from him? I've tracked him leaving the old OSF hospital. He completely disappeared from all systems after that. I hope he hasn't been captured by the government. My brother saved Fubuki. I'm sure of it. We have nothing to worry about. That reminds me. I wonder if it's true that former Major General Karin and Luca were both duds. I'll look for him on my end, too. Besides, you guys don't have the luxury of worrying about anyone. They're calling you demons and hypocrites in Suo. Well, great. Our stocks are limited. If you don't make contact Call with Togetsu see or Seiron soon, we're gonna run out of supplies. How could they do this? They were just hailing him as a hero. It's fine. They shouldn't have been calling me a hero in the first place. There's actually something I wanted to tell all of you. It seems that I was born without powers. <laughs> but you have powers. What are you saying? You know how I was being treated at the old OSF hospital as a kid? Seems like I was subjected to an experiment that caused me to acquire my power. I think the reason why my powers have been on the fritz lately is because they were artificially engineered. It probably puts a huge strain on my mind. Are you sure you're okay with telling us this? That you used to be a dud? Oh, is he sensitive about having been a dud? I mean, hiding it doesn't change the truth. And I figured you all deserve to know, considering all the trouble my unstable power caused you. It's no trouble, really. Yeah, we're just worried about you. It's only natural for us to worry. But thank you for telling us. I've heard there are many people without powers who live their life suffering in secret. It's sad, but I do believe that is the case. Well, and if something ever happens, you know we have your back. Thanks. All right. We should rest here a little bit and figure out what to do next. Ah, oh, wow. It will probably be impossible to recover Nagi's memory data now. 
I guess this means Major General Fubuki's plan will have to be put on hold. So you were admitted to this hospital when you were little as part of an experiment on duds? I can't believe they locked kids in a hospital to experiment on them. Must have been scary. That's unforgivable. I don't really remember it, but thanks for worrying about me. All right, then. Jeez. I'm drawing something really gay. I'm not paying attention. Well, it turns out Yuito was not born with powers. But he has them. So that's pretty fun. You're late again. But it's fine. I forgive you. Uh, thanks. So, what do you want? I have some things to say about the way you fight. The way I fight? Yeah. I've seen you fight many times, and you have a lot of wasted movement. Speak for yourself. You're no longer a cadet. If you want to call yourself an OSF soldier, don't just flounder around. On the battlefield, you need to always be reading your enemy's movements and consider your next no. move. No. Use your brain. I like acting rash. So he calls me here to criticize me? What the hell is he thinking? Hey, are you listening? I'm spending my precious time on your you Your precious time? Hang on. I don't really know what's going on. Why did you want to talk? Because you helped me before, however slightly. I'm returning the favor by giving you some advice. That was advice? Sounded a lot like you were making fun of me. What? You can leave if you don't want my advice. Thought you'd want to get stronger. He's annoying, but he has been in the OSF longer than me. If he really wants to help, I guess I'll listen. All right, I'm all ears. A wise decision. You can't win without hard work. Though I'm sure that doesn't make sense to someone who was born with a silver spoon in his mouth. He can't stop with the insults. I bet he doesn't have any friends. Yeah, I bet he doesn't. Back to the subject. I told you to read your enemy's movements, but it must be hard for an inexperienced rookie to do that. No. Instead Don't of relying care. on hazy knowledge, it's better to work on reaction time and calm decision-making skills. I see. Unfortunately, you lack both right now. It's a miracle you're still alive. Bitch. <laughs> Was it incredibly good luck, or was it your teammates? If you don't want to die young, you need to get better. I listened to you, and all you did was insult me. You hate my guts. Any reason why? What? I go out of my way to help you, and you think that's an insult? Come on, that last bit was definitely an insult. Exactly. Fine. I'll tell you if you really want to know. I haven't liked you since the first day I met you. Since I was scouted, I worked for years to get strong. I've been near death more times than I can count. How could I like someone who was born in the Sumeragi family and pampered his whole life? Who my family is doesn't matter. I'm my own person. No matter what you think of yourself, everyone else only sees the Sumeragi boy. That... that may be true, but... That's why everyone was prejudiced against me, even though I worked so hard. But if I say that, Shiden will have a field day with it. <sighs> if you don't like it, you have to become strong enough to surpass your name. But if you can't listen to advice, it'll be impossible. The fact that a volunteer soldier like you made it into Captain Seto's platoon had to have been because of your family connections. What? Another thing I hate is those dolls you guys collect. Oh my god, fuck that you, Bucky's cool. Or whatever. What's cute about such a weird little thing? There are some things you just don't say. It's Bucky, not Packin. That's rude to Bucky. What's with you anyway? You're just spewing insults now. What? You're the one who complained when I was just trying to give you oh advice. Oh my god. That wasn't Shut advice. It was just nagging and insults. I've had enough. I'm out of here. Fine. 
What's with him? Did he actually think that was advice? It's like he's made of insults. Next time he calls me, I just won't show up. You know, to be fair, I should have just ignored him in the first place. He's kind of a fuck bitch anyway. An update on the program. Let's go. I've added new functions to version 1.1 of the Forced Break program. It's a system that teaches you simple relaxation methods when you enter rest mode. Now give it a try. I didn't come here to test this, Arashi. Why don't you quit developing this program? You came all the way here to tell me that? What a waste of time. You should have just refused when I invited you. No, I think it's important for me to tell you this. Hmm. I'm all ears for your elegant speech, oh great one. It's not like that. I just don't know about forcing a break through a program. There are easier ways to help people relax. You could offer to listen to their problems or give them some advice. Listen. Something Sheedan's not good at, the we'll dumb have to bitch. explore those options. Why don't you tell me about your problems then, Yuito? What? I'm taking your suggestion. You have a lot of pent-up feelings because of all this hard work you're doing, right? So, out with it. I don't know where to start. Like, my family and brother? Chief Sumeragi? That's a bit of a touchy issue. Yeah. I had no idea he was involved in something like that. He even set me up as a traitor. My dad didn't tell me anything either. I understand your confusion. Although I can understand why the Chief did what he did. Does that mean you approve of their methods? I didn't say that. I don't endorse them or forgive what they did. However, the way they're willing to sacrifice their own family if necessary is something I can see myself doing. Damn. Would you be able to do that to Major General Fubuki? You could sacrifice your own brother depending on the situation? I would, but he wouldn't be able to make the same decision. For better or worse, he's still a child. You two are similar in that way. What's that supposed to mean? Children think they can save everyone, but that's not how reality works. There will always be something that needs to be sacrificed. Grown-ups have to figure out the line to draw on what to give up. What the fuck? I think you hate being that kind of grown-up. <laughs> Is that so? Well, you might be right. If I stayed a kid, I might be happier thinking I could do anything. Being able to selfishly slack off whenever I want is something a grown-up gets to do. Pretty cool, right? No, grown-ups shouldn't slack off. You really are so much like him. Can't tell that's an insult or not. All right, there's a couple Bond episodes to do, or I think it's just one, unless... So I'm a rebel. I can't believe Suo is after me. I don't know if I should go to Togetsu or Seiron, but what Seiron is doing is unforgivable. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream now. Me tired. And I got work in the morning anyway, so... As much as I would love to stay up, that's kind of out of my things to do. All right, let's see. Good night, Jordan.
Uh, who do I want to raid is the question. Raid slash host. One of the two. Mm. Is Priscilla still alive? Oh, she only just started streaming, so... That'd be a good idea, actually, to raid her. Okay, I'm gonna make sure I spelled it right. Because I know I'm bad at spelling! I know I'm bound to fuck up eventually. Oh my god, right, the Among Us skin is a thing in Fall Guys. <laughs> Heck. But alright. We're gonna raid Priscilla, who is playing Fall Guys. Good stuff. Um, I don't know when I'm gonna stream. I don't know if I'll stream tomorrow or not. But I also got work. Well, actually, wait, tomorrow? Actually, no, I could probably be able to stream tomorrow, maybe. Fine. No, maybe. I don't know. We'll get to it when we get to it. 